Um, so if you were in charge of NATO, if you were, say, Joe Biden, uh, what would your next move be in the war in Ukraine? What would you do? Peace, immediately. Call back Trump. <laughs> that's, that's, that's the only way out. Call back Trump. Call back Trump. Because, you know, you can criticize him for many reasons. I understand all the, all the discussion. But, you know, the best foreign policy of the recent several decades belonged to him. He did not initiate any new war. Yes. He treated nicely the, 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 the North Koreans and, and Russia, even the Chinese, you know. He, he, he delivered a policy which was the best one for Middle, for middle East, Abraham Accords. Yes. So, so that was a very good foreign policy. He, you know, he's criticized that he's not, you know, he's not educated enough to understand the word. But this is not the case. Fact count. And his foreign policy was the best one for the world in the last several decades I have seen. And if he would have been the president at the moment of the Russian invasion started, no, it would, it, it would be not possible to do that by the Russians. So Trump is the man who can save the Western world and the, probably the human beings in the, in the globe as well. That's, that's my personal conviction.